Hey, it's the Epon with Claire Online Video, and welcome to this tutorial on adding a wiggle effect to your logos using Adobe After Effects Creative Cloud 2015. The wiggle effect is a common look that editors use to enhance and add some randomness to a logo, text, or graphics. I'm going to show you two quick ways and how you can accomplish this look. First, let's start with a new After Effects project. I've went ahead and created a composition that has a piece of stock footage as my background. As you can see, this stock footage has a high paced energy to it and the wiggle effect will match up perfectly with this. I have a logo that's sitting on top of this background and right now the logo doesn't have any kind of movement applied to it. The first way I can add a wiggle effect is with the use of expressions. In a nutshell, these are mathematical formulas that you can use to animate objects in After Effects. Now it may sound daunting, but it's really pretty easy and After Effects does the math for us. Open the logo's position properties by pressing the P key on the layer. Then, press the Option key and select the Stopwatch button. Use the Alt key if you're on a Windows machine. You will see that the position values will turn red if you've done this correctly. Now click in the area where it says Transform Position. Here we will enter our expression. I'll type in Wiggle, followed by a formula of open bracket 4, comma, 25, close bracket. I've told After Effects to wiggle the logo 4 times a second at a motion of 25 pixels. Once you have your values entered, click outside of the box area to apply this. Let's do a RAM preview to see what this looks like. Now you can adjust the formula as needed. Of course, we could have also done this manually with keyframes, but you can see how much quicker using an expression was. There are a ton of complicated expressions out there that you can use. Just do a search for After Effects expressions to start exploring them. The other option for adding a wiggle effect is by using the pre-built effect within After Effects. Navigate over to the Effects and Presets panel and do a search for wiggle. Now you can use any of the effects here, but I'm going to use wiggle gelatin for this tutorial. Drag it over to the logo. If we do a RAM preview, you can see that just by adding this effect, we have a default wiggle that has been applied. Now you can leave this alone if you're happy, but I'm going to customize the effect with options in the Effects Control panel of the logo. Starting with the wiggle speed, here you can change this to a faster wiggle by increasing the value. Beneath that value, you can increase or decrease the wiggle amount. You have even more options to fine tune the look under the transform section here. I'll move down to the rotation area and add a keyframe at the beginning by selecting the stopwatch button. Then I'll move the CTI to 10 frames in and add another keyframe by changing the revolution value to 2x. Now the logo will rotate twice over this period of time. Here's a RAM preview of everything we've applied. This technique is a really cool and quick way to create motion graphics for videos, looping logos, and even events. Give it a try in your next creative project. Thanks for watching, and be sure to check out my other tutorials here on Streaming Media Producer.